Hey guys, my name is Ayana and welcome to a brand new game. Today we're playing Alan Wake 2. So it's been a long time since I uploaded a video. The last video was the end of Star Wars Jedi Survivor. And that was all the way back in July. Today's October 27th. It's the day Alan Wake 2 comes out. Survivor really took a lot out of me and I just needed a break. <laughs> but anyway, I'm back now. I'm really excited to play this. I've played Alan Wake the Remastered. I've never played like the first one when it first came out in 2000. What year was that? I don't know. Um, I never played that first game, um, but I did play the remaster back when it came out. Ugh, I don't even know what year that was. Was that 2021? I don't know. It's on the channel. I'll have it linked below. Um, I am kind of complaining in that series because it was a very hard game for me. Um, so it's up to you if you want to watch that, but it'll be linked below. Um, I also played... Control was the first game I played. That was in 2019. Um by Remedy and then I played Quantum Break second that was on this channel also that would be linked to but yeah I'm really excited to play Alan Wake 2 this is gonna be this is survival horror so it's gonna be scary <laughs> but I'm really excited to see um, what happens and where the story goes and let's go ahead and jump into it okay we're gonna play on normal stories I'm assuming easy Let's play on normal, see how it goes. I did need to lower the difficulty on Alan Wake Remastered because it was so hard. So let's see how it goes with normal. Oh, safe havens. Oh, I'm nervous. <laughs> it's going to be scary. Back to the beginning. We all come to a story with hopes and expectations, looking for an answer. Sometimes it would be better to live with that hope without ever knowing the full story. In a horror story, there are only victims and monsters. And the trick is not to end up as either. But trapped by the genre, we are all ripped to pieces along the way. This is not the story I hoped it would be. This is not the ending I wanted. This story will eat us alive. This story is a monster. And monsters wear many faces. so good it's really bright in this room that i'm in but it'd be way better if it was darker oh my god oh this is so insane it looks so good who are we i can't look at his face okay let me stop spinning the camera around sorry <laughs> oh gosh i might need to make it a little bit brighter but this looks fabulous Assuming they don't see me. Oh my goodness. It's very different than the first game, obviously. Okay, where do I go then if I... Am I trying to get up there? I don't think I can. I'm hearing whispering. Hello? And he came out of the water? What was he doing in there? He came out of the lake. I'm not gonna spoil the first game at all. I mean, I'll obviously have to talk about it, but I'll try not to be too spoilery if you haven't seen it. 
it's a really good game. I like the lore. It's just the combat was so hard. <laughs> oh, he's whispering in my ear. Ooh. Okay, let me make it a little bit brighter. Sorry. Okay. Let's see if that's better. I really love Remedy games. Control? I don't, ooh, hi. <laughs> I don't know if Control or uh, Quantum Break. Oh. My favorite? <laughs> this poor man. What's happening? This tree looks familiar, maybe? I don't know. Something's obviously out there. Oh, we can run. Oh. Well, I don't want to make him run. I feel bad. <laughs> he can barely walk. Anything behind me? No, not that I can see. Oh. That's not good. <laughs> they sound the same as the first game, too, the enemies. I thought that was an axe, but I think it's just a branch. Okay, maybe we should run. Let's go. It's coming? Is that what it said? Okay, we've had a little bit of a shelter here. Oh, hey, that's a safe haven in the light. Light, please. Can I? I can't jump or anything, so maybe I have to go around. Okay, let's go. Oh, I feel so bad for him. Okay, let's get in the light. Excuse me, sirs. I just, you know. Don't touch me. Oh. the lake. Oh, crazy beginning. Oh my gosh. Oh. Hey, kiddo. How are you? I'm good, mom. How are you? This trip might take a little longer than I thought. I'm sorry I've been gone so much lately, Logan. Oh my god, Mom, it's not your fault. People get all murdery. What happened? Just work stuff. Right. Well, Dad and I are just watching the latest episode of Night Springs here. <laughs> Night Mom, Springs? it's so good. No spoilers. I'll let you get back to the show. You were supposed to wait and watch with me. I love you both. This is what happens when you go on work trips, Mom. Mm. Love you too. And say hi to Casey. Tell him to stop brooding so much. Logan? I will. Bye, kiddo. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. 
Alex Casey? Logan thinks you should try cheering up. <laughs> Snarky kid. Wonder where she gets that from. Oh. Hey. I know that voice. <laughs> It can't be a coincidence that another body turns up just as we arrive in town. Feels like the killer's leaving us a message. Hmm. I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. You should take lead. Think of me as the backup. Okay. Any words of advice? Nothing that would cheer anyone up. <laughs> It's weird seeing his face with his voice, someone else's voice, but I also know the voice. Here we are, Cauldron Lake. Time to get to work. I forget what the Alex Casey games are called. I need to look that up. A deputy was supposed to be here to show us to the crime scene. There's the car. So where's the deputy? <laughs> Eaten by a bear? <laughs> I'll check out that map. Oh, invitation. Return one. <gasps> oh, I love playing as a black lady. <laughs> I was really excited when I saw her. Worth memorizing before we get swallowed up by the trees. He has a great voice. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. I should take a look at that map. Okay. You will. I just want to look around. So beautiful, oh my gosh. Bright Falls. What does ours say? I guess it doesn't say anything, we're FBI. I am interested to see how this is gonna connect to the remedy verse, I guess like we call it. Okay, let's look at the map. Okay, the map displays key locations in the area. I think I hear oh, someone again. Could be our deputy. Wait. Go take a look. Let's move so fast. Okay, wait. How do you look at the map? Map displays. Okay. Thornton and Mulligan. They're from the first game. Um. But yeah. So his, I guess, what would you call it? Character model. Um, is the creator direct creative director of the game Sam Lake. And then, I don't want to, should I tell you the voice? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah. Who else he voices, I guess. Hey, over here. Hey. Did we ever see them in the first game? I don't know. Okay, the rental cabins are that way. Hey there. Hey. Agent Casey, right? Sheriff Breaker said you'd be coming by to take Sheriff over the Breaker. case. You're half right. Anderson. Oh. Saga Anderson. I'll be leading this case. Seems you already know my partner, Alex Casey. Shoot. Sorry about that, ma'am. I'm Deputy Mulligan. I just figured that, you know, that, uh... Uh-huh. Show up, Mulligan! Oh. <laughs> Federal agent's right here, Thornton. My partner, Thornton. <laughs> down at crime scene. He's not what you call the sharpest axe in the shed. Why would you say that? They did. Um, yeah, I could use a briefing. Yeah. What can you tell us about the crime scene? Tell them about the heart. <laughs> I was getting to that, Thornton. Why isn't he here? <clears throat> well, we reckon there are some uh, organs that are currently outside the victim's person when they should be, well, you know, inside. Mm -hmm. Any witnesses? Were there any witnesses? Yeah, a couple out of towners. I wonder what they were doing sneaking around the woods at night. I mentioned the city folk. It's pretty suspicious. Not that we have anything against city folk, right, Thornton? <laughs> but don't worry. Sheriff Breaker took them back to town a while ago. Uh, let's take a look at the body. I want to see the body. How do we <laughs> get there? Oh, sure, that's real simple. Just through the hole in the fence, down the hill towards the lake, around the old convenience store. You can't miss it. Okay. Everything's been closed since the area was fenced off. The store, the campground, all of it. Hey, Mulligan, tell him I'm here, waiting. I'll show him around. 
They got it, Thornton. <laughs> okay, thanks. All right, meet Deputy Thornton at the general store. Wow. Okay. Before we get to the crime scene, there's time to review the facts of the case so far. Make sure I'm seeing the clues clearly. Oh, oh, mine palace. No, mine place. How do you? Oh, okay. Oh. The mine place. My version of the mine palace technique. Oh. To sift through clues and work the case. Building the mine place again for each case. Using each field office as a model in my head. Oh, that's so cool. She's cool. The facts are on the board. This is such a cool... This looks like... This kind of looks like where Alan was staying in the first game. I changed her sweater to the Oh Dear Diner sweater for the pre-order. Um, okay. So, case board. Goals. What's that? Oh. Okay. This is... Beautiful. I love the environments in this these games. If you haven't played any of the Remedy games, you should. They're so good. Oh, she has pictures. Is that her daughter? And that's Casey? <laughs> this is so cool. Got a deer head. Wow. Ugh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's go look at the case board. Everything oh. we know about the previous murders. Previous? Oh, right. Worth taking another look. I didn't really look up that much about this game. I, I like to, for it to be a little bit, not, I like to avoid spoil. I guess it's not spoilers, but I like to avoid as much information as possible. Okay, the case board. The case board is a mental technique that allows Saga to analyze clues and progress, progress the investigation. Okay. So you can use right stick to move around. Okay. Oh, oh, this is so cool. Okay, move the cursor. You're not free to navigate. Okay. So cases, nothing yet. And then map. Ooh, which is hut, general store, which is ladle. Witch finder station, a lot of witches. What's that say? It's, it's streamside. Cauldron Lake campgrounds, your home in the pines. Rental cabins, parking lot, bony legged path. Okay. And, okay, I'm here. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so let's see. So confidential interdissemination only? Cauldron Lake, confidential all. Are the Cauldron Lake murders? Okay. Let me zoom out a little bit. Um, I guess we should start at the top. Victims. All victims reported missing in 2010. No other commonalities so we've got ted lane dentist stab wounds bloating bruising on the wrists Ugh. wendy davis teacher body bloated large chest wound oh my god percy wolf store owner bruising heart remove strange tattoos okay oh what's this a series of murders have occurred around the town of bright falls finding the connections will help research for the killer murder method slight difference in the murders bloating only commonality in bodies but not cause of death chest trauma exposed to water post-mortem it's like the first guy came out of the lake um two of the victims had bruising some form of restraint strapped or belted down we saw that bruising on wrists and legs Ugh, it's hard to okay deep gash in the chest heart missing most recent victim died of major chest trauma consistent with 2018 victim what year is this game hard to confirm due to condition of body all bodies experience bloating okay so let me okay the victim was reported missing in 2010 discovered in 2012 buried in shallow grave found in cauldron like 2018 some organs missing predate predation state of body does not match eight years spent in the lake oh okay found two weeks ago chest wound was ruled as cause of death tattooing on body is illegible okay killer profile uh what happens if I oh talk to someone to find the profile? Postmortem tattooing on body. Victim number three was covered in illegible tattoos. A message from the killer, or maybe, or is, or their art. The murder targets have no discernible common traits apart from going missing in 2010. The victims have nothing apparent in common. 2010 is when the first game was, right? I think. Um, chest trauma resembles animal butchery techniques. Oh, killer may be a sportsman or hunter. Oh interesting okay wow this is cool all right um 
let's back up out of here. I think that's all we can do for now. Oh, wait. Let me... So there's the map. Let me actually go back so I can... So that's the... So I need the killer profile. I need to talk to someone. Okay. I think we're good. Let's go back. I see you're already hard at oh. work, Anderson. Close oh. to cracking it. We're just getting started. Okay. Let's so head down the hill to the crime scene. Does not pause the game. Oh. Fucking nature. <laughs> Gives me a headache. You don't like it? It's too much sky. <laughs> what, is he used to seeing buildings? I was um gonna say this reminds me both of Tell Me Why, this forest part, and what's that game called? Twin Mirror, which is weird because they also have a Mind Palace and Twin Mirror. But okay, I'm coming. <laughs> Sorry, there's a lot to see. What's that? Can I? I guess I don't need to hey, look Casey. at it. Oh, oh. You putting me in charge. Why now? Look, Anderson. You're a better detective than I am. Hmm? You've cracked cases that had the rest of us baffled. Oh. I don't want to slow you down. <laughs> Are you thinking of retiring? You know what happens to cops who say this is their last case. Mm-hmm. Real funny, Anderson. Starting fires is prohibited. Please do not feed the wildlife and leave no trace. Raccoons may be cute, but they're not cuddly. Huh? <laughs> So far way down. Stairs are out. You oh. okay to jump down? I'm not that old. Mirror peak. Let's read it. Oh my god, this is so cool. I love this game already. Okay. The mighty mountain in the distance is no other than Mirror Peak. I the iconic landmark overlooking Cauldron Lake. From the right angle, its beauty will be reflected on the calm surface of the lake, mirrored in all its inverted glory. Gorgeous. What's this mean? Oh. Oh, okay. Cool. I like that. So he just waits for me. I wonder what she looks like in her mind place. Is she just like this? <laughs> With her eyes closed. Cauldron Lake Campground. It's so calm now, but I feel like this is really not going to last. Like, it's going to be insane, probably. I want to, like, look over there, but I'm sure there would be time for that. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck! There we go. Okay, I'm going to pick up the pace a little bit. Not a bad place to get murdered. Hmm. If getting back to nature is your thing. Oh, it's raining. Oh, cool. Where's your Damn. hood? <laughs> Should have brought an umbrella. Yeah. I like the rain. The only thing around here that feels like home. You think the local law had the sense to put up a tarp? Hmm. If they did, next coffee's on me. How about your hair? <laughs> That's what I'd be worried about. Oh, here's Thornton. Near the general store. General Storm. Hey! This is really abandoned. Deputy Thornton, I take it. That's me, mm -hmm. at your service. Hi. Ready to get this case solved. Now the body's behind the store. Come on, I'll show you. Okay. I love the way this looks. Oh my gosh, can I go in here? I shouldn't. <gasps> oh, <So>. flashlight. <gasps> Should I have been looking around? That's so cool. <laughs> down serial killers and Shootouts with the mob? You forgot the UFO cover-ups. What? Those are real? You guys hiring? Gordon, he's joking. Let's just see this body, shall we? Okay, wait, I want to look in here. Ooh, okay, uh, let's go to this. Uh, Monday, September 3rd. Something, some suspicious activity spotted. The fielder... Th through, thought he saw movement in the bushes. Footprints around the area were found, but some were compromised by the fielder. A note to self, train the fielder. Whose notes are these? Tuesday, September 4th, nothing to report. Some animals regular. Wednesday, September 5th, hunters out after dark. Poachers heard some gunshots. Not 
one of ours. Gotta keep an eye on these people. They could get more than they bargained for out here. Oh. Okay. Alright. Hmm. Oh, this is a mess in here. So this is 20- is this 2023? I don't know. Oh. Okay, that's locked or closed. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Clue? Collect? What is that? Something for our thing? Okay, we've got cards. And is that it? I love all the noise. Okay. And is that it? Or is this another room? Or is that where we came from? This is where we came from. Yes. And then... Did I miss anything else? I don't think so. Okay. Thank you for shopping here. Wow, what happened? Okay. So they're there. Hmm, hopefully we'll be able to come back through here. And pick up other things. Does it say? Cauldron Lake. It's weird to think of a storming out here. Okay, I'm coming. So that's the way the witch is laid on, which is hut. What's this? Map. Okay. I wonder if this game has photo mode. I didn't even think about that. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, oh god. Forgot what we were doing out here. Now this is the scene of the crime. Uh-huh. We found him on the table. And we didn't touch nothing. You know, procedures and mm -hmm. stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks, deputy. No tar. You owe me a coffee. Okay. Let's start by examining <laughs> our guest of honor. Does this fit the MO of the previous murders? Okay. Oof. Body is positioned on the table. Mm hmm. Ritualistic. Mm hmm. You unlocked your first key image. You can place it on the case board inside the mine place. <sighs> um, up allows Saga to activate clues. The key image can be selected with X and placed on the case board. Okay. Key image. Okay. Ooh, that's such a cool picture. So I can now place this. Another body turns up just as we arrive in town. Coincidence? I want to owe Dear Diner sweater. <laughs> Consistent with previous murders, this is the coolest game ever. Placing a key image on the case board begins a new line of investigation. Okay. Oh. Okay. When a key image is placed, it will prompt a new question. Another body has been found in the woods near Bright Falls. Perfect timing. Need to see if this is linked to the killings we're here to investigate. Object objectives are viewable at the case board in your goals investigate the crime scene. You're not free to examine the case board or leave to complete this objective. Okay, I think that's probably it, right? Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, that's so nasty. You can collect clues from the body to progress. Oh. The killer left the heart right next to the body. They didn't finish because somebody showed up. This poor man, oh my god. Bruising on the wrist from the cargo straps holding him down. Mm. Inside stab wound, chest cut open, heart removed. We got clues available on the case board. Let's go. Uh, okay, newly discovered clues can be placed onto the open question. Loud trucks and cars. Another body has been found in the woods near Bright Falls. Perfect time. Okay, we already read that, uh, I think. So, up. Eesh, it's so nasty. Am I? I'm, the consistent this consistent okay so i don't know if i'm placing i think she's placing them i don't think i'm choosing where they go <clears throat> oh am i oh cargo straps used to restrain victim um sure bruising indicates victim was alive when restrained matches other cases what's this one say okay and oh that's hard Ugh. oh yeah it's pretty nasty Right here. No, how come I can't? 
place it? Drop. No, I wanna. I wanna put it down. <laughs> <laughs> Onto the open. Question. Here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh. Heart removed from chest, strapped by the wrists. Definitely matches the previous murders. But this time the heart and the straps were left behind. More clues to work with. This makes four murders that we know about. Okay. The victim and the killers. The clues have resolved an open question. Oh. Okay. And unlocked a deduction. Oh. As you advance the investigation, new questions will be unlocked. Updating your goals. Okay. You can check the goals. Learn more about the victim and learn more about the killer. You're not free to examine. Okay. So what's this one say? Talk to somebody and talk, find the evidence. Okay. This is kind of reminding me of Sherlock Holmes, the deduction. That was also an amazing game. Who is our victim? Who killed him? Really Need to find more clues. Heavy blood splatter. Large amount of blood on the table. Yes. The victim died here. Yes, he did. Okay. Um, was that it for him? I think so for now. That's really brutal. Is that blood? Or rust? No idea. Or the paint coming off? Okay, we've got two and three here. Footprints? Multiple people were here. Multiple, Multiple. killers? Okay, oh, yes, yes, yes. So we've got two different looking footprints. This looks like a boo and this looks like a normal shoe. We know we were, they chased people. Is that it? Oh, yeah. Okay, what's this? Tripod? Someone left in a hurry. Knocked the tripod over. Oof. Okay. Was it for a camera? Someone was drinking beer. Mm hmm They spent time here. Waiting. I wonder if they were trying to... If Was it the city folk? <laughs> trying to catch a... Uh... Maybe they were recording. Maybe they knew it was going to happen. Okay. Back at the case board. So let's see. Uh, for later. Oh, okay. Um, the killers, right? Let me zoom in. Lots of activity here. It's unlikely our killer was working alone. And heavy blood splatter on the table. The killers. Uh, so this one's soft. Indicating multiple killers. Quite multiple. the party. A multiple assailants present. Assailants? Messy scene, crime of passion, premeditated. Eek, I wanna... They really made a mess here, caught up in the act or just sloppy work. Oh, I don't know. Is that it for the things we have? Let me check the... Okay, the goals are the same. Cage and lock. What? Cauldron Lake. <laughs> My goodness. Okay, is that it? Just four? Let's talk to you. Have you identified the victim? Any idea who the victim is? Oh, I sure do. Oh. His name is Nightingale. Oh. He was FBI. He came to town about 13 years ago. Mm -hmm. Now, I haven't heard a word about him since. Well, oh. until now. Nightingale? Robert Nightingale? Oh, yes. Oh, he was FBI. You probably knew him. Brothers right. in arms. <laughs> oh, and sisters. <laughs> um, okay, so Nightingale's from the first game. That's why I thought it could be Nightingale because on the promo for the game on the Instagram, on Alan Wake 2's Instagram, they show pictures of the characters or videos and yeah it looks like him all right uh you knew the victim so you knew our victim well i didn't recognize him in his mm. current state but yeah i ran into him a few times at quantico never worked any cases together after his partner got killed in the field he went off the deep end mm -hmm. got the boot pretty quick after that he did go off the deep end. Um, so what happened after he got fired? He's missing. Yeah, what happened? Icons at the bottom left corner indicate critical content. So okay, what cool. happened to Nightingale after the Bureau let him go? I only know the rumors. Depression led to booze. Booze led to paranoia. Mm -hmm. He got some wild ideas in his head. Chased ghosts until he fell off the map. Guess he ended up here. Yes, I bet he there's did. more to that story. But no happy ending. <laughs> There is more. So he's been missing since 2010. Nightingale went missing 13 years ago. 2010. The same as all the other victims. Certainly mm. fits the pattern. Makes me wonder what was going on that year. 
Probably no. something this town wants to forget. Uh huh. So this is 2023. Wow. Okay, I like that. All right, so we've got Casey Nightingale went off the deep end. FBI fired him. So this isn't really. This isn't really about the killers. It's about the victim. Yeah. Zoom in. I trust Casey's read on people. Sounds like our victim wasn't mentally stable. Thornton. Victim is Robert Nightingale, last seen in Bright Falls 13 years ago. Okay. Robert Nightingale, ex-FBI, came to Bright Falls 13 years ago. Victim ID'd Robert Nightingale, former FBI agent, mental state questionable at the time of disappearance. No one's heard from this guy in 13 years. Why surface now? Where's he been? Cooler and beer, bo beer bottles left nearby. <sighs> Here? Or, oh no, 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 this is the kill the killers, right? Premeditated or spontaneous. Stalking out the spot, having cold one while they waited for the victim. I mean, yeah, they were waiting there, so I guess it could be from them. Victim, or tripod found near the body. They planned for the murder to happen here. Passing the time with equipment ready. They were waiting for him. But why Nightingale? Mm. He's been missing for 13 years. Why here? Why now? She's pretty. <laughs> Victim came from? Profiling. Get into the subject's head. See what they saw. Feel what they felt. Ooh. Use whatever I know about them to guide my intuition to a revelation. Piece it together. Is okay, profiling. You can now use profiling inside Saga's mind place to get inside vic inside the heads of suspects and victims. Is this how she solved so many cases? Using her intuition, Saga can discover new clues by profiling people of interest. Nightingale. Ooh, he's scary. Agent her. Nightingale oh. has been MIA for 13 years. How did he end up here? She's cool. From the lake that's not a lake. Ooh. It's dark. He was there too. You are not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. Mm. Robert Nightingale came from the lake before his murder. Wait, how did she know that? <laughs> okay. And ritual murder. Nightingale was chosen as the victim. Why? Like the switch, it goes click. Lights are off. But somebody's home. Somebody's home. This wasn't some random act of violence. This was a ritual. A Nightingale a component. They didn't see him as a person. More like a container for something. Oh. How did she know this? How could she hear it? Hmm. Okay. Victim came from... Okay, so Nightingale came from Cauldron Lake. How does she know? I can feel that Nightingale came from the lake, but why now after 13 years? Where's he been? I guess we'll find out more about her. Maybe she's magic. I don't know. The Greater Washington Area. Oh dear diner. Breakfast. Fantastic burgers for the kids. Delicious drinks. Oh god, that's so funny. I love all these details. Okay, um, and then we got the map. What's the red mean? Do we have a legend? I guess not. Okay, let's go back. The lake is connected to Nightingale somehow. Casey, oh, let's take a look down by the lake. Lead the way. Sounds good. Uh, this way, right? Right. Well, okay. Well, I'll just uh, I'll just wait here. Oh, I'd be so scared to wait with him. Oh. Okay. Down by the river. Oh, I still want to go and explore, but I don't know. This one of your hunches, Anderson. Did something happen at the lake? I think Nightingale came up from that direction. From the lake. Probably looking for shelter. Safety. They mm. were waiting for him. When you're ready, I'd love to hear what you put together so far. Sure. It's not that complicated. Nightingale was out in the woods alone at night. Possibly nude. The killers knew he was here. Ambushed him. Dragged him to the campgrounds. Strapped him to the table. Cut his heart out. But then they were interrupted by those witnesses, the bookers. Bookers. The job is unfinished. That seems pretty complicated to me. 
What was this guy doing skinny dipping at this time of year? Haven't figured that part out yet. Mm-hmm. Lots of questions. Lots of answers for us to find. Um, you can turn off the nudity. I only did that because I didn't want the video to get, like, anything to happen in the video. So that's why he was wearing his little undies or whatever at the beginning. <laughs> but I'm sure he wouldn't have been wearing clothes. Um, Cauldron Lake. Which is ladle. Is that the way of the witch's ladle? Ooh, I heard a bird or something. I didn't know trees got that Ooh. big. That's the tree from the beginning. Gives me the creeps. That's you need tree. to get out more. I really think it we is saw this tree in the first though. game. I don't know though. Okay, let's read this. Why well, she have a Ooh, she looks familiar. A witch with no heart. Oh. A strange echo of owl murder. Yeah. This game is so cool. <laughs> Which is ladle. There's no mystery in Cauldron Lake being named after its cauldron shape. Okay. And yet there's many mysterious stories about the lake. It's it being a gloomy doorway to the underworld underworld or of a witch whose cauldron is the, the lake really I can't I read. <laughs> or of a witch whose cauldron the lake really was. The legend tells that when the affections of the local sheriff went unanswered, he accused the lady in the lake of having bewitched him. Oh, she was drowned, but her ladle grew into a strange tree named the witch's ladle. The, wom the woman returned to avenge her wrongdoers if she was not a witch before she, she was one now. She killed the sheriff, drowning him in the lake. Then she took out his heart and locked it in a box. With the heart, she would summon him from the lake to exact her revenge on her behalf. To exact revenge on her behalf, or so the legend goes. All right. Let's keep going. Oh, we gotta walk inside of it? Ooh, creepy. Or are we just looking at it? Oh, it's a blocked path. Okay. Oh! Oh, we got two There's things. a piece of paper on the ground. Oh. Yeah, there is a piece of paper. I can't pick it up. Oh, it's moving! Ah! Oh. The something was one of their... something. Oh, I can't even pick it. Why can't I pick it up? Tracks. Barefoot. Evidence. Oh, Nightingales? From... Oh, but this was open. They come out from under the boulder. It makes no sense. Hmm. Why can't I pick this piece of paper up? It's hard to read, too. Felt like something was a message. A message was a message? Not the last? Hmm. Let's see. She did pick it up, just kidding. <laughs> a page full of text on one side. Not a printout. Written with a typewriter. Old school. Lines scratched out and edits added with a pen. Mm-hmm. Like a manuscript. Mm-hmm. Page of a story. Mm-hmm. Mm. Killer left a message. It's for us. The text is about us. The victim was one of their own, FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. And then there was the page they found, the first step down into terrifying depths. Oh. Reading, Reading the, words. the words. These words felt like a message. Felt like a message. Someone knew they were here, someone playing a game with them. An invitation. How, How could they, they not accept, accept even, even if they, they knew it would end up hurting them? Someone's been watching us. Playing a sick game with us. You were right. This is right up my alley. <laughs> Nightingale came this way. Either he dropped this page, or the killers left it for us. Hmm, the page. Okay. Manuscripts can be read inside Saga's Mind Palace. Footprints emerging from under the rock. The victim came from the lake. What, he walked through the boulder doesn't make sense. Yeah, it doesn't. Trail has gone cold. Victim I think came he from. came from the lake. But his tracks make no sense. Too many unknowns doesn't make sense. Asking the wrong questions. A dead end, literally. 
Reading the words, these words felt like a message. Someone playing a game with them. <laughs> can I? I don't think I could put that there. Where can I put it? Uh, here? Anything else here? Yeah. So the killer is watching us. Game on. <laughs> Manuscript pages. I want to read it. The victim was one of their own, FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. Gone missing here 13 years ago. Now he had suddenly turned up only to be murdered in a brutal and bloody ritual on the very day of their arrival. And then there was a page. This page. The first page they had found, not the last. The first step down into terrifying depths. Secret truths trembling beyond the threshold. Reading the words. These words felt like a... M felt like a message. Was a mess. Was a message. Someone knew they were here what they were doing what <laughs> what they were doing someone playing a game with them leading them on an invitation how could they not accept the sheer audacity of the impossible mis mystery presented to them even if they knew it would end up hurting them okay and profiling the page we found a page in the woods a story about these events what is nightingale's role in this these words close to my chest now. Inside. So the awful truth. You must dig it out. Something was put inside him. Ooh. In his chest. I must find out what. Is that why they wanted his heart? Okay. Found so all I can here. Oh. Time to properly examine the body. See what I can find inside. I don't want to do that. Ew. Okay, I need to get back to the body. Ooh, I don't want to. I carry his words close to my chest now. Okay. There's... Inside. The awful truth. There's more going on here. There's more going on here that I'm seeing. I need to examine the body. I see. I think something's been put inside Nightingale's body. Let's tell the deputies to get the body to the town morgue. Oh. Okay. So they're gonna do it good. I don't I don't want to. This is so crazy. Like, how does she hear? Oh, there's his footprints. Okay, we gotta go back now. Uh, you show me, because I don't know. Can I go this way? I kinda want to. Whoever wrote that page made sure it read like a story. Mm-hmm. Like a scene from a thriller. I hate all of it. <laughs> find more. I believe it. But what's the purpose? They're twisting events to create their own narrative to do what? Entertain some fantasy? Projecting their desires? Are we characters or the audience? Witnesses to their design? All the above? It's all about control. Oh. Deciding what happens to who. Don't let it drag you in. Too late. I'm already hooked. I need the next chapter. Can't go any further. <laughs> Control, you too say? Deep. Which finder station? I was like, why does his voice sound like weird? But it's on her radio. Ooh, look at that. That's so pretty. Oh my god. Is there a photo mode? I don't know. Oh, here. There he is. <laughs> I love this game so much. Did it's so fun. Lost, Anderson? No. I'm exploring. Quantum Did you know this entire home? area is inside a caldera? This whole mountain used to be an oh. active volcano. Imagine the that? force it took to carve this crater out of the earth. Calderas are pretty rare, so be sure to take it in. So, essentially, we're standing in the gaping maw of hell. You got it. I used to love geology when I was in school. I helped Logan build a great baking soda volcano for her science fair. Cheating on a science fair? That's almost a crime, Anderson. I'm not gonna say no to quality time with a volcano. I mean, my daughter. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized... Um, doesn't Alan Wake write Alex Casey books? So how is he right here? <laughs> I'm just now realizing that. Hmm, I need to play those games. What are they called? I gotta look it up. One second. Wait. No, no, no. Okay, so so Max Payne is is the games. Alex Casey is 
Alan. No, no, Sam. <laughs> What's his name? Good. Not Alex Casey. What's his name? I hope you didn't get stuck in any of those big puddles. Crazy flooding down there, huh? Just like I said. I'm getting so confused. Alex Casey is that guy. But then, isn't he in the books? I don't know. And then Max Payne is from the, the games. Okay. <laughs> All right, anyway, let's get back to, let's get the body back. Deputy, I want the body taken back to town for a proper examination, ASAP. Well, sure, but the coroner won't be back in town for another week after deer What? Fest. Not a problem. Oh. I'll do it myself. Oh, and Sheriff Breaker called to say he's got the bookers at the Odeer Diner in town. Oh, and I've got a key to the gate. It's a shortcut back to the parking lot just up the hill. Oh, thank you. I like him. Okay. Thanks. Take the car. Um, Let's get the car. Drive to Bright Falls and talk to these witnesses, the bookers. At the diner, right? I, I could use a cup of coffee. Let's try that shortcut the deputy mentioned. Sounds good. I'll be back okay, in a second. Dear diner. Roger. Um, I don't want to examine the body myself. That sounds absolutely disgusting, but <laughs> I guess we'll have to do it. I'm going to keep these videos around an hour. This I'm at 59 minutes already, but I think I took a little extra time in the beginning, so I'm going to go for a little bit longer. Oh, what's this way? Hold on. I think I saw something. Oh. It'll only take a minute. I'll wait here. Okay. Oh, okay. What does it say? Oh, you're moving. Stop moving. F F FBC security perimeter? <laughs> Gate for entry for authorized personnel only. FBC? The Federal Bureau of Control? Love that game. Federal Bureau of Control, Research Department Laboratory. Oh, I want to go. I love it. Hello, this is Agent Anderson and Agent Casey, FBI. We'd like to come in and ask a few questions pertaining to an investigation. Well, looks like we're not going in there anytime soon. Oh. Nice talking to you, too. So there was someone there. Because they hung up. <gasps> oh my gosh. I'm so excited. I'm going to go this way. Oh. 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 Well, look at this. Wait. Is this convenient? This isn't the convenience store, is it? Or is it the back of it? A creepy twig sculpture? Hmm. Don't step on it. Wonder what's inside. I should take a look around for a way to open this thing. Confused? Follow these steps. Wash your hands, take the chicken out of the fridge, take a nap. Oh. So it needs a code. Oh. Okay, cool. Oh, I'm gonna have to write stuff down. Um, wash your hands, take the chicken out of the fridge, take a nap. So, wash your hands. Let's go find a sink. And then we've got another one flashlight. Hey, this looks familiar. Kind of. Okay, where's the sink at? I actually just want to look around. Sink. So, let me draw that. <laughs> Do triangles intersect it? Okay, that's sink. Number one. Wash your hands, chicken, and fridge. So this is, uh, take a nap. So that's number three. And two triangles facing away. And then two. Let's go find the chicken. Oh, what's this? Uh, let this be a warning to you, to fellow trespassers. They say the lake is a caldera, something formed by an erupting volcano, or the sinkholes it leaves in its wake. But what if that's not true? What if it's something else, something less natural, more, much more man-made, intentional? Uh, I say the lake's not formed, it's designed, and it has a purpose. The lake is its hiding is a hiding place. Beneath the calm surface lies a secret machinery ready to be activated at the press of a button. And the people with the button, they're in that big house by the lake, preparing, I know it, the big house. The FBC gate? 
First drawing, water line. Rio Caldera is made from a volcano. Oh, okay, the drawing's on the page. Lava. Second drawing, water line, engineered structure, strange machines. Okay, cool. Okay, so let's go find the chicken. Hey, Casey. What's the forest's favorite shape? Please, Anderson. Just <laughs> one case without the A triangle. I don't oh. get it. Yes, you do. <laughs> I like them together. Okay, what's this? Deer head. Hey there, Mr. Deer. Why you you remind that? me of a dream I had. Ooh. Don't touch it. Ugh. That's sad. <laughs> okay, so the chicken and the bridge is two oh I'm stuck on something. Get get off the box. Okay. So two triangles again. Interesting triangles. Let me put chicken. Cool. Yay! Alright, I think we've got every clue. Let's open this. I feel like this is not made for us. But I mean anybody could figure out that puzzle, so who knows? Okay. So first we've got two triangles. This, I think. And we've got up and down. Like this, and then we've got facing away. Right? No. <laughs> wrong. Oh, I had the triangles the wrong way, I think. There we go. Okay. Don't take anything if you aren't one of the trees. Oh. Well, I am. I'm not a tree. But I don't want to... I'm not going to touch anything. Hopefully this will be... Well, maybe I can just examine it. Oh, I did take it. Oh, no. Well, I guess I'm a tree. <laughs> oh, we have a pendant on the gun, I think. Okay. Well... That's for our mind place. Can put the, way, the flashlight away. Oh, there's so much in this forest. Let me check the map. Uh, is there an easy way to check the map? Nope, that's not it. Mm, I don't think so. Okay. Maybe I should meet back up with Casey <laughs> as I go down this path. Oh my god, I love the sound of her jacket swishing. Okay, okay, let me let me go back. <laughs> I'm getting ahead of myself. We'll get back to town and then I'll end it. Wait, what? Oh, he's over here. We better be able to go to the FBC gate. Good to see you still in one piece, Anderson. Hi. <laughs> Forest can be a dangerous place. Okay. Uh, key to the Cauldron Lake. Okay. Seems like a nice town so far. Murders aside. Pretty woods. Cute lodge we got set up in. We should go for a hike if we get a chance. Now you're just being mean, Anderson. Deputies aren't exactly up to the task, but hopefully the sheriff will be more helpful. Not a surprise about the deputies. Doubt they see much stuff this gruesome. Um... I don't know what I was gonna say. Oh, we are hiking pretty much, right? <laughs> All the stuff we're doing. Ooh, look at the light, so pretty. Do you wanna go first? You go first. We're walking into each other. Or should we wait to get back to town for the next video? Maybe we should. Yeah, okay, we should maybe stop it here. Alright guys, that's going to be the end of this first part. I'm absolutely loving this game, and I can't wait to see more and see all it has to offer. And yeah, so I hope you guys are enjoying. If you want to um, see when I upload videos, make sure you're subscribed. And if you like the video, make sure you leave a like, and I will see you in the next part. Thanks for watching. Bye.